Farage's wife is German and the couple, who are separated, have two children both speak German and Farage said their German identity was important but he insisted both were British and would support England in football matches by Tim Sculthorpe, deputy political editor for Mail Online published, 1011 EDT, 19, April 2018, updated, 1255 EDT. The 19th of April 2018 Nigel Farage has admitted two of his children have German passports and will keep free movement rights after Brexit Nigel Farage has admitted two of his children have German passports and will keep free movement rights after Brexit. But the ex-UKIP leader insisted while his children value their German identity they were still British, and would support England in football. Mr Farage has four children, two with German wife Kirsten Mayer. The couple separated last year. He confirmed his children would keep rights as EU citizens that millions of Britons will lose after Brexit in a podcast interview with ex-deputy Prime Minister Nick Clegg, asked directly if his children had German passports, Mr Farage said, yes, yes. And that link to the German side of their family is clearly important to them but their identity, when it comes to a football game? it's pretty clear which side they're actually going to support. Their mum may not. Although he insisted both are British through and through, the former UKIP leader added the children speak perfect German apostrophe. In other remarks, Mr Farage claimed anger among younger voters at Brexit would fade. He said, I'm astonished that the young people look upon the European Union as being this bright, shiny future. Mr Farage made scrapping the EU passport a central part of his campaign for Brexit but has not previously confirmed two of his own children held German passports Mr Farage insisted the younger generation's love for the EU will quickly diminish as he blasted the block for disintegrating before our eyes apostrophe dot he went on they will change their minds. What you can't see is that the European project is disintegrating before our eyes. The leading Brexiteer also emphasised the UK was a loser in the Second World War because it bankrupted the nation. He explained, We were the ones who lost everything. He added, The end of World War II marked a period when our big imperial possessions started to disappear. Advertisement.